Hi, I'm Ivan Zud. I am Clipper Guy for Jatai Academy, J-A-T-A-I.net on the web. And today we're dipping into the Clipper Guy mailbag. Ask Ivan. Clients want to know. And some of these questions are questions lots of clients want to know about. So I thought it would be great to post a few of them and share the answer. If you've got questions, go to clipperguy.com, click on Ask Ivan. Name, email address, question. I'm here to help. Happy to help you out. Today's question. Hey, Clipper Guy, my hair is dry and damaged. Help! What do I do? The answer is a few things. Number one, dry and damaged hair. Some dry and damaged hair cannot be revived. And one of the best things you can do is cut it off. If you can't fix it, bail on it. Get rid of it. If it's dry and splitting and the splits will carry up the hair shaft, it's only going to make a bad situation worse. So we'll start with the bad news. The bad news is really damaged hair. It's not hair anymore. Hit the road. Time to cut it off. Short of that, let's talk about some other real solutions because that's not the solution you wanted to hear. Next is reduce heat. Find ways to style your hair with less exposure to the drying and damaging heat that is many times the culprit for folks that have severely dry and damaged hair. We see people all the time out in public where they're just toasting their hair with a flat iron. Give it a rest. Wear it curly or wavy a couple of days a week. Cut the heat in half and you'll cut the damage by much more than half. Reduce your dependence on the flat iron, reduce your dependence on the round brush and the blow dryer and the high heat and the pulling. Reduce your mechanical stress on the hair. Mechanical stress comes from that brush, it comes from the plates of the flat iron, it comes sometimes from the ponytail holders and the scrunchies we put hair up in. So reduce the heat, reduce the physical stress. Next on the list is conditioning treatments. Read your conditioning treatment labels. Protein conditioner for strengthening can make hair dry and brittle if it's overused. Moisturizing conditioner for dry hair in the right amount can really go a long way to help with dry and damaged hair. But sometimes that damaged hair that stretches a lot when it's wet is protein deficient. Too much moisture is not going to fix that problem. So you really need a good professional assessment of what is the damage really looking like. Frequently that stretchiness, that really nasty damaged hair is the result of a little too much service at the chemical services bar. Time for the bartender at hair color to cut you off. Too much bleach, too much overlapping of uh, straightening treatments. Excessive exposure to chemicals can contribute significantly to damaging hair. So the two suggestions here, the two sides of this conversation is, how do I prevent my hair from being damaged? Be nice to it moisturize it, reduce exposure to heat. What if I do if my hair's already damaged? Preventative care doesn't work. Appropriate conditioning treatments, the reduction in excessive chemical services, and the bad news is potentially a really good healthy haircut. Hey, I'm Clipper Guy. I've got a lot of great short haircuts for people that have two feet of bad hair. Sometimes it's time for a reset. Maybe we've got to start short. I know that's not what you wanted to hear, but sometimes with damage, it's what you may need to hear. I'm Ivan Zood. I'm Clipper Guy for Jatai Academy, J-A-T-A-I dot net on the web. And with questions, hit me up at clipperguy.com.